Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Well, I am so glad you guys are here and I apologize that I haven't uploaded videos in a long time. Guys, it has been a roller coaster trying to find houses and settle down. But that's a story for another video. However, this is my quarantine day two and I think for um three and four days yeah so this is the day two and i was about to take my covid19 test i got my test kit from dante labs at about 69 pounds so if you're considering um, trying to take a test i recommend them their services were cool they were professional right um so i got this i had to open it up take the i think the throat swab um, I just saw a single swab in the box. Yep. Um, so this was me trying to read up online because I think I had to register the kit for so that it would be traceable. Yeah. And then just trying to read instructions and really scrutinize the test kit. So this were what I found in the test kit. You can see you have um, different things. I think that's an instruction booklet. Yes, that's an instruction booklet. And these are seals for the test. So after you take your test, you seal it up in this bag. And this was the swab so I had just a single swab in the kit and then I read up that I was supposed to use the swab on my throat and then my nose I was about doing it in front of the camera but I decided to go offline and here I am back with my sealed sample so I have to put it back in the trackable um, box that was sent alongside the test kit and then search for a royal mail around me to drop it off in my next video i think you'll be able to see what a royal mail looks like for those of you considering entering the uk from a green list or red list country i think it's going to be useful and make your quarantine period seamless so this pack is already has already been paid for so all i do is drop it off and then the royal mail dispatches it to dante labs and then i'll be able to get my results via my email Sefini, we're done All right, so now we are at Lidl supermarket. This is a German supermarket. So join me. Where did you buy your camera from? That's one of the things I said I would buy when I come. Um, uh, Tesco. Okay. No, no, Okay, so let's see what we're gonna get from Nida. Because I have a Argos thing. So okay. Loyalty card. Okay. Well, I'm in Coventry and let's just go in.
Are these live plants? Yeah. Or synthetic live plants? So people, we are Lidl and this is a very pocket friendly supermarket. I can recommend them. So if you're a student, you should consider getting grow here. If you're in Coventry or if you have a Lidl around you, check them out. Their prices are not um, pocket cracking. Is that the word? Well, um, you can join me. There are mangoes. So these were mangoes. Like these green and red items were actually mangoes. Well, not so much difference, but they were really big. I think these are grapes. Right. Yeah, these should be grapes. Um, just had to pick up one or two things. Uh, frozen foods. They have chicken. They have Frankfurt. They have um, hot dogs. They have a lot of things there. There are also household items. I think like pots, pans. Um, I didn't check those out on this particular day, and that's because we came for just food. Um, we also picked up ready-made pizza or half baked pizza i think you'd have to put it in an oven to make sure it's properly so these are pizzas we're picking up when i had to pick up um, a couple of other things and this is just us moving through the supermarket um they also had italian biscuits so my host um is from italy she has been in italy for a while and she was really happy to see italian biscuits it's not something that is common guys these biscuits were expensive but you know when you find something that you've been craving the money is no longer a thing so guys we are making pizza join me as i make pizza pizza so guys i'm gonna make pizza <laughs> oh the pizza is already made but uh -huh. anyway i'm so sure i'm making it um if you remove it i don't want to get a Stop on that, yeah. Okay. You might put flour, flour on that thing. Oh, okay. The normal. Yeah. So, this one. If you want to use the one, two, yeah. This and. Oh, okay. This is why you are saying you cannot dry the fish because it's light. Yeah. It's electric. No, it's electric. No, Not fire. Saying, when, I, when I buy a chicken, mm. yeah, this one's okay. You know, I don't mind. Wait, they already cooked the chicken already. Okay. But the tiny, tiny head, yeah. I, was okay. I tried to burn Fry it. No, burn it. it like it's not burning. Yeah. Like the way they roast goat. Yeah, goat something like that. Yeah. In Nigeria. So they have different flavors, yeah? Yeah. Of the pizza. Of the pizza. No, I just bought one flavor. Oh. Those ones, they are still the same thing. Okay. So we'll put this one here now. What flavor is this? This one is margarita. But because I love a lot of uh, this thing on this, yeah? So I have... Some toppings. Yeah. I put the top. Mozzarella. We want to test the level. We have got a, you know, at Lidl. What that is called? Drinks. Don't have drinks at all. Soft drinks. Can we order? We don't order. What will you order then? They, when they come and they, when they finish, they can go to off license. When they are going off license, you can go with them to go and get it. Yeah, because today is my. Three days. <laughs> I have a friend that's gone out for seven hours. <laughs> really? <laughs> she said it's a free day. Oh. <laughs> so when they are going to off last and say, so you go with her to go and get. Or you can even go with Fiona. So she just hold her hand only for cross play. Yeah? So what is this really? Eh? Is this like cheese or something? Cheese, something like cheese. Oh. 
Guys, homemade to, pizza. Go to wait for now. So it's already pre pre prepared. What can we do with them? So they are fine. So they can share this one out. Okay. These are Italian biscuits. Really? Guys, the test of this biscuit is heavenly. I'm telling them that they taste like so guys this was what the pizza looked like man it really did taste cake. nice it tasted nice well thank you thank you for watching i would share my day five and uh, my first shopping you know my first first things after that i had okodo i prepared okodo which is yam and plantain porridge yeah with some of the spices i brought from nigeria i brought pepper soup spices i brought catfish and hmm, this meal tasted nice like it tasted lovely so guys see you in my next video thank you for watching subscribe if you haven't and you know let us collabo going forward bye